Hi guys, making a video. I don't know what happened. I just had, I was five, four or five minutes into a video and I looked at the camera and it was off. So this is the second take of this. We're going to be turning those into these baskets here. It's kindling. They're about 18 inches long. And these are about 12 inches by 12 inches. So I guess that's about a, a one and a half cubic foot per, per bundle. Um, so it'd take a few of them to make a cord of wood, but I, I know I've had that many. I got, I got these baskets all over and I was, I was working on trying to, thinking about trying to sell them as kindling, but those are 18 inches and then I cut them in half to, those are 9 inches, but then I cut the length of these down to 16 inches instead of 18 inches. So I'm just kind of kicking around all sorts of stuff. Oh, here's some wood I put in here the other day. I wonder what it dried out to we're into everything it was at 10 pounds one ounce it was just two pieces let's see what it's down to I don't remember when I put it in here eh, it's lost that's nine and three quarters and lost much there's ten on the money so it's ten so it's lost lost a couple ounces I, I didn't do any real good thing like I used to do with weighing wood anyhow um, I generally have have those things stacked up here two sometimes three rows deep and quite high I got to find some more of these that are running around that are empty you got to put paper in there because the little squares at the bottom those pieces some of them will go through um, anyhow that's uh, this will probably just be a filler a filler video but it's 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 just stuff I do and stuff I got to get done so um, I'll bring it around for a little bit. You can, you can see me. I'm not wearing mittens. Um, I could wear mittens, uh, but I'm too lazy to go find them. So uh, it's just just kind of what gets done around here, you know. And then I'll I'll have them ready. I've been I've burned quite a few of those. All those empty containers in there, I burned in the um, boiler this year. Uh, ouch! Got my first splinter. No, it didn't didn't stab me too bad I'm trying to uh, get to the front here maybe to get these um, these things out I just made some more of those if you saw in the sawmill um, I cut that pine uh, just the other day cut that pine the other day and that's that's what I made just to increase these racks so they can, they can hold more I mean the more you get into it the more you get into it did you guys ever play uh, Lincoln Logs when you're little the roofs on the Lincoln Logs look like this. The old Lincoln Log cabins. Um, anyhow, there's uh, a lot of wood in here. Now, I don't know how much wood this is. You can see about how high it is. Leave a comment in the line, thing below. How many of these boxes of wood or crates or milk cartons? Uh, which one do you think I'm going to get? It'll be interesting, and then when you get down to the end, um, we'll figure it out. So leave a comment. How many, how many containers of kindling am I going to get out of this? And this is uh, this is pretty good stuff. I don't know how 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 clicky it is. It's pretty clicky. Um, I don't have any real set order on how I'm putting them in those those boxes. This one here looks like poplar. That probably won't have to click. Now this is oak. Yeah, it's still pretty clicky. I try to put a, an array of bigger stuff and small stuff in those boxes. And this is the stuff that really starts fast. And if you get a real wide one, you can just bust it. And I'll tell you what, that stuff... Uh, if I just keep playing around with it here, this stuff is so dry, if I if I could probably I should be careful that I don't start on fire. It's been sitting down in this wood all has been sitting in a barn down there by, by the sawmill. Um I don't know. I don't run out of jabber. It's just something that you normally do. I guess a lot of people are gonna say, how come you don't have gloves on? And like I said, either in this one or earlier or or the other one that just, uh, I started making a film, came out and looked at the camera and was off. I better, better check to make sure this one's still on. Yeah, it's still going. <clears throat> you 
gotta lay these on the side or they don't they don't uh, fill up quite right. They just kind of go like in here, all hodgepodgey. And um, so I guess it's not really much. This is kind of one of those videos where I wish I knew how to edit and zoom forward all the way to the end so you could see how many I get at the end. But then you couldn't answer answer uh, the question. Right now, I'm just about burning nothing but this stuff in the boiler. Uh, just it's been pretty warm here, and uh, I don't need don't need to get a whole lot of heat out of the boiler. I just need to kind of keep it going. If you stack it up, it's all it does is sit in there and get all black inside with smudge. There's a poplar one there. This is almost all oak. I, I don't I don't even remember cutting it to be honest with you. need some more little ones. I don't know if this is... There you go. Now we're getting it somewhere. Be easier to get them out. Oh, that one's still tight. It's just half inch pine that I gnawed up and put this thing together. I wish I hadn't used this rack. I kind of like these racks. They, um... Uh-oh, the boiler just turned on. And I don't have but two pieces. I only have two pieces of wood in it right now. Until it, uh, you can see when it just fired off. That's blowing all the. Actually, that's probably steam, even though that wood I know is bone dry. That's that wood that's probably ten years old in there. And it it should go to clear stack. So we got two things going on here. So I'll, you can kind of keep an eye on that. At the same time, I keep loading this and uh, see what we come up with here. I know there's only two pieces of wood in there because I just put them in there. So it's, it is fresh wood. I don't care how, how, how good your boiler is. When you put fresh wood in that fire, in a uh, fire or boiler or anything like that, they're still going to smoke a bit. And that thing's probably burning off all the soot that it's got inside of there too from burning slow. Some days are clear days and some days are not. But it's oak, it's in there, and I know it's at least, I don't know, at least five or six years old. And I only put, I only put two pieces in there, because I didn't want to over fire. I should have put this, this nice crispy stuff in there. Uh, then you gotta roll it up and shake it around and try to stick a couple more in there. If you put too many in there, you can't get your hands in. That got, it got pretty tight. Then you grab a big one like this. This is right good size. That's poplar. Now she's ready for inside. I'll set that one there. I'm surprised that hadn't gone to clear stack by now. That's kind of uh, strange. I, I think I got the. It looks like I got the blower on. If, you, if I don't put the blower on, it smokes a little bit more, but it doesn't, it doesn't get so hot in there. And this is, this is what I'll be doing until I get this one empty today. I don't know if you recall, uh, back at the sawmill on maybe a past video not too long ago, there's a bunch of, uh, wood in the um, ready uh, trims ready for cutting back there and so I just got to get make room for them so I'll put the first first set of those trims in this thing then the second second trip up I'll probably put them in the um, that trailer I gotta fix a tire on the trailer the trailer's got a flat tire I can just air it up I've been airing it up for years one tire goes goes flat. I don't know if it's got. I don't think it's got a nail in it. I think it's more like a rim leak. I guess the flame is taken off now. It's I don't know what what is it in the movie? Maybe a couple, two or three minutes. Getting hot and it's starting to heat up in there in the boiler now. You can see it's starting to clear out. 
I think you guys can still see. There's a nice chunk of yeah, that's poplar. We'll put that down in this one. This one now, once you start getting to the top, you got to put the smaller pieces in. Um, so you get them in nice and tight. And that's about, about what happens around here. Just, just another. It ain't all. It ain't all saw milling. So there's a nice cubic foot and a half of wood there. Put some of these little ones in there. Tighten it up. Can't even get that in there. There's a few, few of them can fit in there. Uh, then, like the last one, you get one here and nubbies from when you cut it off, off. See now we're clear stacking over there. It's just about clear coming out of the stack over there now it's warmed up. I think you can see it in there. I can't. The screen is only about a two inch by two inch thing. It's kind of hard to see. Ugh. Well that one ain't coming out yet. All right now we're going to take them I'll just flip this around a little bit. We're going to go all the way to the back of there. I see there's a stool in the way. So, I will get it out of the way before I go carting that in there. And believe it or not, this cubic foot and a half of wood is heavy. Bring a couple empties out. Yeah, this is this is heavy. All right. Well, I got a bunch more to do. I'll set up. There's where we're at now. This is come down. This one here, I think, will be Oh, uh, and you need need a square to set it up on here, or it won't uh, be at the wrong angle. I don't know how to explain it, but you want it. You need to tilt it back. It just kind of the luck of the draw on how you get that. And there I go for the next next bunch of them. Ugh. Man, that one just don't want to come out of there. That's all right. We'll get in a little bit. Anyhow, I'm not going to torture you guys through this anymore. I'm going to, I think is what I'm going to do. I think is what I'm going to do is finish this all up. And instead of, I might, I might write in a title how many I got out of this. Don't forget, at the, uh, after you watch this, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and hit the bell to get notified of other ones because that's an important thing to do. But I think is what I'll do is I will, well I don't know what I'll do because I'm so backwards and my mind's so twisted all the time, but what I kind of plan to do right now is finish this off, get those in there, I'm going to do a short of what's going on, so don't watch that short, but then the next short will probably say how much is, how, I'll show how many I got of them, so that's where we're at and I'm going to sneeze. <coughs> That's some of the things you need to edit out if you knew how to edit, but 
Old fat boy hadn't learned how to edit yet. <laughs> so I'm glad you came along to listen to my sneeze. Um, and I'm glad that you're here. And don't forget to put a guess how many crates I'm going to get out of this thing. See you later now. Bye-bye.